How do you think it felt to step out onto the water? To hear Jesus' word saying, Come. What does it look like today to respond to his challenge? To take his message of love to the ends of the earth? To be a part of a movement so much bigger than us? To give our all, saying, Let's make the next wave. Before my DTS, I was really shy. I didn't like to talk to a lot of people. I was very much, I very much kept to myself and I was very lost. I had a, a lot of expectation because before I did uh, uh, the DTS, my heart it was uh, full of uh, hatred, lack of uh, forgiveness. And during the time I, I, was, I was there taking the classes, God was uh, working in my life, um, changing me uh, to, to his way. Before coming to do my DTS um, here in San Pedro, I was really confused. I didn't have any goals or any direction for my life. I didn't know what I wanted to do. I felt like my family was calling me in one direction where I had to go to school and just lead a life of going to university and just doing what they wanted me to do. And it wasn't until right before I was about to graduate that a friend of mine, she told me about YWAM and she came back from her DTS. And that's when I really started to feel God was calling me out to missions and just a life to, to depend on Him for everything. And, and this time, um, I've been, I would say, I've, I've been changed, transformed, and hoping how to receive uh, what God had, uh, had installed for me. And during the test, also, it's a, like a big challenge. You know, you have uh, the, the, the financial aspect where you have to raise your own uh, support. And uh, me, uh, myself, from, from Haiti, uh, it's, it's not uh, really, really uh, I would say, easy for us to raise uh, support, but God uh, provided what I needed um, to um, start the school and uh, finish up the, uh, the school. During my DTS, it was, I was challenged physically, I was challenged emotionally, really in every way possible. That really stretched me and helped me grow. It helped me be able to really um, put into practice what God was telling me to do and to share God's love with other people, to talk to people, um, and just try things that I didn't want to, but I know that as a Christian, I should not be afraid to do those things for God and for love of God and for love of God's people. A missionary is someone that gives his life and his time to help others and not worry for something back. A Discipleship Training School, or DTS, is a five-month intensive training course with three months of lectures and two months of outreach. DTS aims to equip and train students for a lifetime of Christ-centered service. The core theme of the school is to know God and to make Him known. During the school, students will learn more about who God is, His character, His nature, and His ways. Each week, students will hear from a different guest speaker who is an expert in a specific topic. Lecture topics include the Father Heart of God, destiny and calling, hearing God's voice, among many others. DTS will help students learn more about their identity in Christ, God's purpose for their lives, and how to live out their faith in everyday life. This is a time where I have seen people be transforming. Uh, I have seen people being healed and founding in God the love and the satisfaction that they were looking for. I have seen people being real with each other like never they were before because the Holy Spirit created that environment that made that happen. I chose to do my DTS because I wanted to have a deeper relationship with God. And through the five months of my DTS, I felt that God showed me a lot of different things in my life. And one of the things that I felt that I grew closer with God is just to be able to depend on Him more. Um, the, the teachings that we had throughout the lecture phase really helped me to see the areas in my life where I wasn't depending on God, whether if that was through finances or just in um, my area of faith. And so, yeah, everything I felt helped me grow closer to God and just uh, make my walk with 
with God stronger. I challenge you, if you give Him your all, He'll give it back to you in ways that you could not even imagine.